Hi, everybody. Thanks for joining me tonight on Turner Classic Movies. I'm Ben Mankiewicz. Robert Osborne has the rest of the evening off. In this week's edition of The Essentials, Robert and Drew Barrymore brought us the classic boxing drama The Champ, which also served as the inspiration for the rest of our programming tonight. Coming up next, Danny Kaye stars in just his third feature film, playing a singing milkman who becomes a prize fighter. From RKO in 1946, it's The Kid from Brooklyn. The movie is a musical remake of a Harold Lloyd comedy produced 10 years earlier called The Milky Way. Danny Kaye plays the Harold Lloyd role, a shy milkman who accidentally knocks out a boxing champion. And before you can say down for the count, Kaye is stepping into the ring himself. A couple of years earlier, producer Sam Goldwyn signed Danny Kaye to a lucrative movie contract. The question for Goldwyn then became what to do with him. Kay had unique talents, and the challenge Goldwyn faced was creating movies that gave Kay an opportunity to showcase the skills that made him Danny Kay. Sure, Kay could sing and he could dance, but so could a lot of other people in Hollywood. Kay stood out because he could do so much more. He possessed a knack for tongue-twisting songs, monologues, improvisation, and physical comedy. So Danny Kay movies were designed to let him do his thing, and audiences loved it. In addition to his movies, Kay also had his own radio show. The Kid from Brooklyn may have been just Kay's third film, but he was a star on the rise. And if he looks nothing at all like a boxer, well, that's definitely part of the joke. From 1946, here's The Kid from Brooklyn. 